Hey guys, what's up? It's John Apoffle, and I'm back playing Luigi's Mansion. You might notice it started a little bit differently. I didn't start from the beginning of the mansion because I would immediately cut to here, and I thought that was a waste of time. If you remember on last episode, we took out Lulasis and captured a few more portrait ghosts, completing Area 3, and now we are on to the final area of the game. I just will also want... I got the water spirit on the way here because... There's this interesting thing that Nintendo put in the game, making you want to help the environment a little bit by watering the plants and it gives you money. So, that's what I'm doing right now. Fulfilling Nintendo's need for helping plants. Alright, that's it. And as you know, we got the key because we completed Area 3. So we're going down into, or not down, but. Oh! Well, well, well. That's unfortunate. Criminy! What a calamity! Ha, ah, criminy calamity. The, elec the electricity has gone out! He has light in his house? How is that fair? He's like, what, two feet away from the mansion? Ah, whatever. You can't see anything in this blasted dark. What do you. Look at. You're egad. You can't see anything because you don't have eyes. That's why you can't see anything. Anyways, if we look at this, we I can go inside, and I will do that, but I also don't want to forget that I have a few things I can do now that I turn the power back on that I didn't do last time. Remember the couple pieces of cheese I was talking about? Oh, gotta answer the phone. Supposedly, when you answer this phone, when the lightning strikes, it's, there's supposed to be a picture of a hanging Mario, but it's just Luigi holding the phone in the corner. Um, how do we want to respond? Yeah, it could be a jerk now. Whatever. Woo! It's me, Toad! I don't know what I would have done if a ghost had answered. Anyway, I, we have a terrible problem. The lightning caused blackout all over the house. What should we do? Wait. Oh yeah, I forgot. I was about to ask why the telephones are working, but I realized telephone lines are separate and they can still work. But whatever. Apparently, Toad is a super afraid of the dark. He's crying again. Oh, someone else is calling. Jesus Christ, all these people calling. Hello? What? Egad. You... <sighs> this is this is why he's retired because he finds more entertainment in getting a call on a phone than he does talking through a creation that he made that he called me too much more than two seconds ago with. All right. Oh. Well, there he goes. Money! All the money, all the money, all the money. Mine, mine, mine. <laughs> Alright, so... Basically, you have to clear this room of all the ghosts, as usual. But one of the things that's really awful is that the lights don't come back on. Because the power's out. Which makes sense. So... Oh, there he is. There he is. I was looking for him. But... And that means that even if I quote unquote clear this room, it doesn't it doesn't turn the lights back on and more ghosts can just spawn. So without further ado, I'm gonna capture him. And that freed the doors, as you heard. So let's go in here, because you know, oh why not? Oh, we can't. Well, that concludes the journey on the upper floor. I will see you on the bottom floor because that is the next place we have to go. Look at all the Kirby's flying around. Look at them. So happy. Alright, welcome back my friends. And oh my god, so many ghosts. You have no idea how long it actually took me to get here. Just because of all of the ghost encounters. Anyways, we're gonna pull this off the table because as you remember one of those other times when I was trying to suck something up. It messed me up. So, take a picture of that. Oh, did I already do this one? No, I couldn't have. There he goes. 
Money everywhere! Alright. So we got a second bit of money. Oh, things coming down from the sky. No! Not you. Understand why you're in the kitchen, but not you. Get out of here. Get out of here. Um... You'll notice that I'm not really going after ghosts, and I said it before. Only in that room did I need to suck up all the ghosts, or quote unquote, all the ghosts. Because nowhere else does it matter. And it's kind of... I, mean, I, I don't know how else to say it other than ridiculously annoying. To have to get the power back on and all the like massive amounts of ghosts that show up. So we're back in the father's room. And... Um, in here, there's the first piece of cheese that I remember telling you that I forgot. So there it is. Dark does a stick taking pictures of chairs, Luigi. Come on, get in the game. It's funny because he's in the game. Uh, bad jokes. Uh, bad jokes are great. Oh, yeah, an emerald. That is why we love our little friends, the, uh, mice. Anyways, we're going to turn on the power again, because I hate the dark, yay! Interesting story, actually. I, um... I used to be terrified of the dark. I'm, like, I'm still not comfortable in it, but I was, like, really terrified of it. And, um, being so terrified of it, I literally would... Like, in my basement, if because we keep our drinks down there, I would start at the top of the stairs where the lights were, and I would sprint as fast as I possibly could. Like, so fast, to get down to the stairs, and then come back up. Jesus. They're trying to kill Blossom! Protect Blossom with your life! Come on, Luigi! You can do it, Blossom. Blossom's life is on the line. But actually, only in maybe like a couple of years ago or so, did I get past this fear of the dark. And we're watering Blossom. Yes, look at him. This is why we like Blossom. As I told you, we beat Area 3. Look at this money. This is fantastic. I'm pretty sure that diamond alone is worth like a million or something. It's just worth a lot of money. And it's because it's a fun little thing to do. So this is Nintendo secretly telling you, water your plants and care for the environment, and it will pay you back. Except in this game, it literally pays you back. Oh my god, so many ghosts! Anyways, we're going down into the basement now to make it less dark. Hi, guys. I want to shake my head in shame because... I can't turn off the power yet. Oh my god! Oh my god! And I can't turn off the power yet. Because there's too many... Yeah, I don't have a certain key because... If I was listening to Egad, he said something about Uncle Grimly, so we have to go get Uncle Grimly. Ugh, I'm so sorry. There he goes, he's having a heart attack. Nice to see you. Wait for him to have a heart attack and you suck him up. So anyways... Uh, I feel really ashamed of myself. And I was gonna say, you know what, I'll restart the recording and keep going at another time. But... Oh. God damn it. Uncle Grimly, how could you do this to me? This makes me really sad, because I basically, I'm pretty sure, just lost gold on Uncle Grimly. Uh, it's really tempting to restart the recording. But you know what, I'm not going to, just because... I want... I don't know. I don't like... Doing things over and over again until it's like super perfect and great. I don't know, I feel like that takes some of the element of human likeness out of it. Alright, so for real, we're going to the basement, and for real, we're turning the power on, and for real, I'm not gonna be stupid. So I will see you down there. Hey guys, what's up? We are heading down. We're at the right side, going down the staircase to go into the next room and turn on the power and save the rest of the universe. Basically just this mansion, but to me it's the rest of the universe, it might as well be. Because, really. 
<sighs> Booyah! Turning things on. I like how much effort that took. But look how nice it is in here. Look at the light. Does that not light not make you so happy? It's like it's like God light or something shining down on you and showing you the greatness that is to be held. I can't speak English. But we already knew that, so no need to worry. I don't know. Let's see where this next boo is. He's in the same place. There he goes. Alright, I am Booby Hatch. What the heck? What kind of name is that? Get out of here. Get out of here. Get, out get over here. What are you doing? You know what? I'm okay with this. Just stay. Oh. I thought he was gonna stay like that. And I was gonna be really happy. But no, we can't all be happy. So. We have to go get Booby Hatch. <laughs> I feel so wrong saying his name. There he is, Booby Hatch. He went back. Of course he went back. Things aren't allowed to be simple. Alright. Oh! 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 He's in the barrel! He's in the barrel! Who cares about monkeys in a barrel? Ghosts in a barrel, guys. That is the new... new hit thing or whatever. Oh, oh god. Oh god. Oh god. I knew they were storing some drugs down here. See that shroom? Shroom that flies out of their storage. It's obvious. Obvious. Oh, yeah. Keys! <laughs> Luigi had to punch the wall first before he could pick up the key. Alright, yay, we could go back to this the third floor, oh my god. But first, I'm going to catch these two boos. Figuring out where this one is. There he is. Boo repeat. Repeats. What the? I didn't read that right, but whatever. Get out of here. Get over here. No! Stop! I hate when you booze go in here. Are you are you kidding me? Oh, well, Boo Repeats is gone, and I'm gonna go off screen catch the other Boo. Be right back, guys. We've got 40 Boos! Yay! You're busting all kinds of techniques, Luigi. Yay! Yeah, because techniques and booze. Yeah, whatever. Alright. He didn't come back yet. So, I suppose that means we're going to the third floor. See you there. What even is this? And we're back in the room with telephones. I'm sorry that this video has so much skipping. It's just because there's lots of forward and backward tracking and all that crap. And I don't want to force you guys to watch that. It's kind of really boring. No one really enjoys watching backtracking. At least it, I don't think you do. If you really do, I'll, I'll do it. But it's kind of... I don't know. It's a lot of time to talk through. And it's really boring. Because I'm just saying, I've seen all this before, yay! But whatever. As you saw, we had to re-clear this room because it was dark before. And it was dark again. We never reinstated the power in it. Oh yes! Oh yes, give me all of the monies. Luigi, you could buy a real mansion with all the money you're getting. So, I, 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 you know what, I suggested, just abandon this piece of crap, and get a new one. Seems like a pretty obvious answer to me. I don't know, uh, I, oh, yeah. what would you guys do if you had as much money as Luigi? What would you do if you had all of this money? Like, he has so much money, if you think about it. I mean, I don't know what it might actually be, like, small, like, pathetic amounts of money and whatever Nintendo money decides to be. But if it's, like, it's still over, like, 19 million or billion dollars, that's a lot. Clockwork room. What are you doing? Oh my god. <sighs> well, anyways... 
I'm not gonna go after him. I'm going to capture the clockwork soldiers. I don't remember what you have to do. Oh yeah, you have to make all the clocks go off. So you're about to hear so many annoying noises. Except it's like one of the few pieces of music that you ever hear. Uh, they're the mo one of the most frustrating groups of people to get because there's three of them and they try to all get you and stuff. So you have to be really, really careful because they'll try to shoot their pop gun thing at you like that, just like that. Then you get this one, yay! You get all of them all the time. Oh, they always break away from you. But as long as you get maintain good health. Should be able to get them all. Come on, guys. I have two at once. Darn it. Two at once is always never gonna end it well. You should never try it. It's, it's, a, it's a bad decision. No, no, get away. It was not that you shoot to me. Oh, too bad. I didn't get shot, but it wasn't a good thing either. Yay. Oh, okay. Okay, this is good. Let me. Let me just reiterate. This is one, of, probably my second, the second hardest boss or ghost in the game for me to capture. The first one being Bulasis, because I hate Bulasis and he's just annoying. Tediousness. I'm getting these guys in a terrible order. Jesus. Two of them are almost dead, and I haven't touched them. And like, I'm going after the green one. Let's go, both of you guys. Come on. Come on. Yes! Now it's just you, buddy. It's just you. You don't have to worry about all those fiends getting in the way of our love. I'm not a creep, I, I swear. It's the love between a boy and his toys. And I mean, totally not related to sex at all toys. So you might as well just dismiss that thought immediately if you ever had it for some reason. He's a worker walking around toy. Yay! And I think that's it for this episode. I've been Jolie Poffel, and I've been unfortunately having an off day, but you know what? I don't like doing re-recordings too often. Maybe if I really screw up, I will, but nothing super bad happened. So thank you for watching, and I hope you join me once again next time.